I come from a small town in regional New South Wales called Canberra. <laughs> it's been cold there since like Federation, hey. <laughs> I live with a mostly silent man, uh, two teenagers and too many condiments. <laughs> if I buy one more bottle of sriracha mayonnaise, we're gonna need extensions. I use the condiments to gaslight my children into dinner table conversation. <laughs> They're teenagers, not really up for a chat. I just find if you pop a cup of chilli in a spag bowl, <laughs> really gets things started. <laughs> They're like, Mum, what you do to the pasta? I'm like, nothing, why? Are you having a thought or a feeling? that you'd like to express, because I'm here, Mummy's here. <laughs> COVID's messed with my extrovert status. Like, I look forward to seeing people, I look forward to going out, then when I'm out, I'm like, this is bullshit, I'm exhausted. <laughs> it's good to be here. Uh, one of the things I missed most in lockdown was the blessed relief of being around people who don't know me. When you're an adult, strangers can be nicer to you than your own family. If you're gonna do something good, make sure it's seen by people you don't know. They'll give you the recognition you don't get at home. <laughs> like I could cure cancer and my family would be like, we didn't have it. <laughs> What's for dinner? <laughs> I'm looking for a sus accountant if you know one. Um, I thought I had one because he advertises on a trailer down the shops. Um, <laughs> business starts with triple A and uh, he doesn't ask for receipts, for which I'm grateful. Um, <laughs> but I'm not getting enough back. What you want is an accountant to the stars. You want one with a previous client who's gone to jail so he knows where the line is, you know what I mean? <laughs> So I'm not getting enough back, you know, like what are you bringing to the table, mate? If it's just maths, I'll get my year 12 son to do it. What I'm looking for is loopholes, brother, or you can get the fuck out of here and I know I'm in your office. <laughs> I know. I, you know, and I know what it's all for. Like I, I believe in universal healthcare and roads and shit, just why do I have to pay for it all? <laughs> Can't Rupert shout, I'm sick of this shit. <laughs> you know? Now, I know there's only two things in life guaranteed, death and taxes. I just wish it came in that order. <laughs> Look, I can't recognise birdsong, but I can tell people from the way they walk, right? So guys that walk like this, they're called Tristan and they work in IT. <laughs> and they're going home to recreate historic battles with miniature figurines. <laughs> I reckon nerds are the happiest people. I can see them when they're walking along. They're just going, when I get home, I'm gonna smoke the traders of Nogger off, <laughs> Nick and Milo, and have a wank. Thanks very much. <laughs>